Where you at, man? Your house is empty. Ah, oh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert, out by Alamo Sea. All right, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Uh, oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Come and Trevor! Uh, bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner, good guy, very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> uh, listen, I'm beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened, and that, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Merriweather. Mm, those assholes. Big yeah. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to uh, requisition it. Fantastic. Let's go. Oh, man. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go. <sighs> the weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip. But... Great, right, let's go. <laughs> what are you going to do? We're not. Gonna take out a private army on the ground, Ron? We gotta meet him in the air. I... Uh, well... Okay, well, look, I knew that you were pissed after the Merriweather heist. Giving back the hardware. That was bullshit! Right, right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merriweather networks. Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I gotta. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultant's fee and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards. Merchandise! I want to make gun violence and drug dependency accessible to every man and beast from Hove Beach to Vespucci! I want country clubs! Oh, and a depressed wife with blonde hair! And a hot little secretary who bounces on my boy! Maybe if you'd buy into Oscar's business? I'm hearing there's a lot of bounce in the firearms sector. Well, I heard there's a lot of bounce in your head. Where's the TP Enterprise windfall, huh? It takes time! Time and money. Sure, and Michael Townley, Whoa. the Santa, the fuckface, is gonna give that to me. Crop duster? That's the best we can do? Call our guys south of the border. Tell them there's a fire sale. I'll get you on the radio. Plane is in a holding pattern to 
right ahead of me! Got the weapons they're using to enslave us on board! If we can get a hold of them, oh my god! Are you planning on forcing them to land? Didn't I say we had to take them in the air if we're to have any kind of shot at this? I thought I said that. You did. It's just I don't see how you're going to... Ah, you'll see. Keep low! Remember! Don't want to give them reason to think you're suspect. Altitude corrected! We're flying by the military base now! Avoid it, boss! Don't fly over! Yeah, I'm reading you. Yeah.
There's been a change of personnel and destination on the Merriweather jet. We are now landing at Mackenzie Field. Changing frequency, over. Browning, the cargo jet is now part of the TP Enterprise fleet. You with the Mac? Welcoming parties here, Trevor. Fly safe now. I saw the plane go down. I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank God. The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. Ah, oh, good idea. But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask. Are you in with the federal government? An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the garage, the cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear.
Doc. Hey, it's me. Michael. Que pasa, amigo? Not good. Things have been pretty fucked up. You seem particularly confused, Mikey. Tell me why. <sighs> Things are bad, Doc. Really bad. Tell me all about it. Sharing is winning. I'm out in the desert now, Doc. My wife left me. My kids. Oh, Christ. We upset some guy, but that wasn't enough. We stole his wife. Now we gotta leave town. I'm living in a trailer with my psycho old buddy Trevor. He keeps killing people, Doc. I mean, you know, shit. Me too, but... Ah, oh, Christ. Things are just really fucked up again. You've gotta make more time for therapy, Michael. This is a major relapse. Have you... acted out in any other ways? I ain't been a good boy, Doc. I mean, you know, things just... all of a sudden get up on top of me, right? Fucking on top! And then I lose my shit, and I hurt people, and then I feel bad about it. I, I'm a fucking prick. Remorse is good, but not as good as taking control before you act out. I really just want to be happy, Doc. That's so bad. Okay, okay. Anything else? What about sex, Michael? I'm doing well, Doc, in that regard. Nothing to report, not one single thing. That's great, Michael. It's real progress, see? Treatment works when you try. Ever since I pulled that fucking house off that fucking hill, my fucking life has been fucking fucked. The thing is, Michael, <laughs> you know me. I'm not a sugar coder or a script writer. I mean, we tried a full range of pharmaceutical solutions a couple of years ago, and that went nowhere we want to go back to. Agreed? Agreed. I ain't doing that again. Pissing myself, crying, sleeping in dinner, howling in the middle of the night. Fuck that shit. Maybe we got the doses a little wrong. You're going to have to get yourself under control. Listen, next time we meet, perhaps we should meet back in my office. But, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm afraid face-to-face -face sessions have got a little more expensive. I thought you said phone sessions were more expensive. Well, they were, but I realized that wasn't fair, so I raised the price on face-to-face. -face. I'm sure you understand. And if you don't, maybe you should. Be well. Listen. I'm not talking to you until you calm down. You drugged me and ditched me on the sidewalk? A talk is the least I'm owed. Don't you see the drugging is like a symptom of your own breakdown? Oh, I'll give you symptoms. How's a cracked skull sound? Goodbye, psycho. Get some help. thinking about it. I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to accept an apology. Where is my wife? Trisha doesn't want to speak to you. Frankly, neither do I. I will find you! Okay. Well, I'll put some coffee on then. I'll see you soon. Martin. Hey, look. What have you done? What have you done? Where is she? She's safe. Oh, huh. Look, I'm gonna find a way to make this right with you. That will take some doing. 